hello guys and welcome back to this channel so in today's video i'm going to i need you to pay attention because if you miss any step from this particular video you're going to make a mistake and you might not be able to do this particular drop perfectly and and then many of you, you skip the video and you start commenting or uh, dropping comments in the comment section whereby the video have already answered your questions so pay attention to every single thing i'm going to say as regards this particular airdrop now the airdrop i want to show you guys is called sonic sonic happens to be a solana based project and they've raised 16 million us dollars so far they raised 16 million us dollars so, so far but based on their tweets right here they're having 12 million right here but in total as at now they've raised 16 million us dollars and this 16 million us dollars are from tier one ventures the likes of okay gazi and the likes and it also includes partners from you know uh, partners and uh, funders and core contributors from this particular project the likes of coin telegraph bong Jupiter, solana and so many other ones like that so in order for you to do the test narration i'm going to show you so the first thing you want to go and do okay sonic is the first atomic svm layer tool built to enable sovereign game economies on solana so it so this particular project is actually related to game and at the end of this video i'm going to show you guys some of the things that you need to do because you need to be doing 100 transactions every single day and i'm going to show you how you can do it without breaking the sweat like in the space of five minutes you'll be able to do this particular transaction so i'm going to show you guys so just pay attention so the first thing you want to do is to go and install this particular wallet right here back pack go and install it on your browser and uh, so you are seeing remove right now that's because I've already installed it and and it's already on my PC right here. So if you are using a mobile phone, just go to the the extension, uh, the extension angle of the of your browser and then install this particular browser, uh, this particular wallet right here. So this is a wallet. So let me open mine right now. This is how it looks like. So just set it up the way you normally set up a normal a normal wallet. So just go ahead and set it up. So once you set it up and have your password, have you save your seed phrase somewhere so make sure you save your seed phrase now the next thing you want to do that you want to do right now is to is to add is to add uh dev i mean is to add is a, a custom rpc to to the uh to the particular wallet that you just created so all you just need to do is click on this so come over here and click on this and then click on settings so once you click on settings then you're going to see you're going to see where it says well, wallet solana and this so, so all you just need to do is to click on Solana. So once you click on Solana, then click on RPC connection. So once you click on RPC connection, the default is going to be this. Like it's going to show back back default RPC. So what you want to do is to click on custom. Once you click on custom, then make sure you enter this particular URL. So this is the RPC that you be that you're going to be using. Then click on update. Then, then, then you are good to go. So once so once you've done this just come back right here just come back right here and click on your wallet right now you click on your wallet and then you come over to this come over to this faucet i'm going to put the link to this faucet in the description below so once you come over to this faucet just place your wallet address and then click on and click on it now you notice that there's devnet.sonic.game and there's also api so what you want to do is to make sure that you have devnet.sonic.game selected as you can see there are two right here so what you need is this so make sure you select this and make sure you've done the verification right here and then click confirm airdrop so this is going to send a, a testnet token to your wallet so if i open my wallet right now you notice that this balance right here will increase to like around 400 now as you can see so this has increased so what you are seeing right here is not real solana it's a test is a exactly a testnet token so 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 you are getting closer to to where you are going to use this particular solana right here for transactions so so after that you come over to this particular website right here i'm going to put the link to this in the description below so that you can use it to sign up so the, so the first thing you need to do is you well, once you come over here then you're going to click on connect right here so there's going to be a connect button right here so you connect your wallet so after you connect your wallet it, uh, it's going to show you uh get started then just click on the it's going, it's going to show you like welcome to sonic odyssey it, it, i mean it, it's not going to show now right now that's because i'm already doing this particular testnet so 
it's going to show you welcome to sonic odyssey campaign and then just click on the get started button and once you click on get started button then you just click on meet sonic so let me let me come over here so i've already connected my wallet click on get started so this is meet sonic so once you click on meet sonic click on this and then these are uh, these are the tags that you need to be doing so you need to connect your your twitter and your discord you need to join right here so once you've so once you've done this and this you're going to win three three ring mix three boxes so you're going to end that you're, you're going to end that and you're going to see it right here if you see my box right now i'm having 67 right here so so you're going to have three once you've done this particular one right here so that's the first that's the first step and the next one you want to do is click on checking right here you click on checking and then you make sure that you log in every single day so right now i've already had seven days checking right here so I've, I've been doing this for the past seven days so so right now we're just going to click on this so that will make it the eight days so click on approve okay so the checking has been completed right now so that's how you carry out the the check-in right there so the next thing where the main the major work is is this transaction milestone so this transaction milestone now based on what they want you to do they want you to do transactions every single day and if you do up to 10 transactions you're going to claim these two two mixery or uh, these two ring mixery boxes right here now if you complete 50 transactions you're going to get four and if you complete 100 you're going to get six so if you so if you do if you complete every single one of them so you're going to get six plus four plus two making 12 so every single day you'll be getting 12 right here if you are able to do this 100 every single day so that's just the uh the, the, that's just it now you can you can easily go and look for some uh, some wallet address and start sending to them and you have to get to like maybe 100 or or 50 or 10 transactions in a day but like i said there is a better method or, or, or faster method so, so to say and and i and i actually hope that it is not going to get us uh, disqualified anyway so this is how uh, this is how you're going to go about it in order for you to do this so the first thing you want to do if you want to do this particular thing is that you make sure that you have a github account okay you have a github account let me show you so if you don't have a github account you, you need to get one so this is uh this this is a github account right now this is actually my dashboard is majorly for you know developers and all i know that don't worry you're not going to do anything uh, you know anything a little bit uh extremely technical so so i'm going to walk you guys through how you can go about this now once you have your github account the next thing you want to go and do is to own a git port account so it's gitport.io this is gitport.io so i'm going to show you guys how 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 you can do that so this is gitport.io this is gitport.io so the first thing you want to do is make sure you you register for free so it's going to ask you whether you want to pay for premium or you want to or you want to use it for free and all that so just opting for that free version so i'm using the i've been using the free version actually so just click on try for free and all that just follow the prompt right there so it, it might even ask you to to add your linkedin account so that you could get higher much higher free resources and all i know that you so it, it is actually your choice you can decide to add your linkedin to it and you can decide not to not to add it just connect only your github account so so once you have your Git, a github account this is my dashboard right now so you're going to have something like this so you're going to have something like this once you set up your your or you want to set up everything you're going to have something like this so so one more other thing that i need to show you as regards your wallet is when you click on this and then click on this click on this then click on your wallet so once you click on your wallet then make sure that this this wallet right here is on sonic origin and not on solana make sure you switch this to sonic origin so so i'm doing this because before we start i need you to switch from solana down to this sonic origin so so once you click on this it's going to you know it's going to mark and that will be all so once you have it like this so you have connected this sonic origin to your to your main wallet that you have here when you created the 
this whole thing. So it's not as if it's going to create another wallet, but you still that same wallet, but you're having it as Sonic Origin rather than Solana. So that's so that's just it there. So that's one thing I, I remember that I, I, I didn't talk about earlier. So now what you need to do is this I'm going to put the link to this particular GitHub account. Like I said, you need a GitHub account. So so there's this bot Sonic I I saw on Git I saw on GitHub and what it, it will actually help you to do is that it's going to generate hundred hundred different wallet address and then it's going to send Solana to each one of them. So meaning that you will be able to get hundred transactions that you want. That is just the beauty of it. So I'm going to put the link in the description below. So if you want to do this, you are going to need this. So the first thing I want to do is is go back to GitHub. So this GitHub and then you're going to come over to this uh, to this workspace. So click on configure your own repository. So click on configure. Then you now go back to this GitHub account right here. Then you now copy the link. That's github.com slash monoralim. Uh, that is the name of this this particular person right here. Slash bot sonic. So so I'm going to copy the link, the link, uh, the, the link to this page. I'm going to copy it right now and then now come over here and paste it here. So, so this is the link right here. I'm going to put this link in the description below because you are going to need the link here when, when you are writing some commands that are, that are here. So this, this is what you need to do. I've already pasted the link and then click on enter. So once you click on enter, it's going to load the, all this, uh, all this, uh, VS code standard and all that. Don't need to select any. Just leave it on default and click on continue. So, so this is going to load up and you're going to see the interface right there. But mind you, like I said, you are going to need your seed phrase. Okay. You're going to need your seed phrase. Okay, guys. So you're going to see something, something like this. Once you, once the page has already load up. So this is what you're going to see. So the first thing you want to do, you want to do is to pay attention to this terminal right here. And you're going to paste something right here. So what you're going to paste is going to come from this guy, this guy page right here. So you're going to start from here. So what we just did earlier on is to clone the repository. So we've already cloned it by using by using this. So the next thing you're going to do is to install dependencies. So you're going to install dependencies, which is number two right here. So you click on this, click on this, then come over here, and then you paste. That is Control V. We are using Mac. That is a, a command Command V. So you paste this NP NPM, then space install so once you once you paste this then you click on enter and it's going to you know it's going to read like this up to date for details 69 packages in 7 or 3 milliseconds and, and all that so once once this is done then found zero vulnerabilities so the next thing you want to do is this you are going to create a file so the name of the file i'm going to show you so this is number three this, this number three right here is going to come over to this number three you're going to create an env file so make sure you copy let me copy this env file this env rather so make sure the the dot env the dot right here is not missing so not just the env alone you need to copy the dot dot along with the env so once you've done that you come over here and then click on click on new file so once you click on new file you paste the dot make sure it has as you can see it has dot right here make sure it has dot then once you paste it, you click on enter. So the, the file is going to be created as you can see dot env. So what exactly, well, what's the next thing that you need to do? You come over here again and you paste your seed phrase. Copy, copy this command right here. You copy this command and paste it right here. So this is seed phrase. Then this is where you're going to paste your seed phrase. You need to do is come over to backpack and go over to settings. Click on setting then you're going to see preference okay it's not here you're going to see your account then you're going to see show secret recovery phrase so once you click on this once you click on this so it requires me to enter my password right now so the password that you use when you are creating this wallet is what you're going to enter right here and then you click on show so once you copy this this seed phrase you will now paste it in between right here in between so let's just say dog cat cat elephant elephant goat mosque hamster and so on and so forth like that you know uh, your cipher will either be 
12, most likely going to be 12 because mine, mine is 12 as well. So you're going to have your seed phrase just like this, okay? You're going to have it. Make sure this, so make sure this punctuation marks right here, this closing, uh, this, uh, this one right here, this and this are there. So, so the seed phrase has to be in between them. So what I will do right now is to go and copy my own seed phrase and paste it there. So right now I've already pasted my wallet address, which I, I mean my seed phrase, which I believe you as well, you must have probably pasted yours right now. So the next thing you want to do is to come over here again, come over to terminal and then go to, go to this fourth one right here. You're going to see MPM run start. So click on this and then come over here again and click on paste. So once you click on paste, you're going to, so once you paste this, you press enter. What we happen now is that it will generate 100 different addresses. So once it's generating, after generating it, it's going to start sending Solana that you, that you have right here. This Solana that you got from the faucet is going to start sending it 0. Point, I think 0 0.01 is going to start sending it automatically. And all you just need to do is just to wait and, and let the thing do, you know, you know, just do it, it whole thing. So, so let me, so let me click on enter right now. And as you can see, so you can see a whole lot of them right now. Now, if you notice right now, it has sent, it has sent, uh, this, these are the address, these are the addresses that was, that was generated, this green right here. And if you look below right now, it has already st started sending 0 0.001 Solana to each one of them. So it, so it will keep sending just like this, like this, like this, like this. So this is how it's been done. It will it just be going automatically, okay? So so I'm going to leave it alone, let it do its magic. But mind you, while this is ongoing, you can come over here. If I reload this page, you will notice that, it, you will notice that this transaction right here will, will increase. So let me show you, let me refresh this page. As you can see, so I'm having 11 transactions already. So this was me doing it automatically without you know having to look for any wallet and other and sending 100 transactions to them manually so this is as you can see 11 and that exactly what is going to happen till it gets to 50 50 uh 100 right here so all you just need to do is just click click on claim to uh, uh these two mystery boxes right there so let me click on it and it has already been added and we have from 69 down it has jumped to 71 right here so once this one gets to 50 i'm going to claim for so you can claim it just like that and you can decide to you know just wait and and let the whole thing finish first and before you start claiming so once you claim all you just need to do is this you come over here click on you click on this you click on open mystery box if you click on open mystery box it's going to load like this now you can now you can open it one after the other or you can click on open or if you click on open all, because I'm having 71 right here, I will have to sign this contract 71 times. That is just, you know, that's just the tax right there, the other tax that you need to do. Because you need to open this mystery box and get and get this ring right here. This is my own ring. This is my box and this is my ring. I've already gotten 66 already. So 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 all you need to do is to open this box in order to get this ring right here. That's exactly what you need to do. So the, so the next uh, the, the next one that you can that you can do so i'm going to leave this why this is ongoing on uh, background so the next thing you want to do is go to game adventure you click on game adventure you are going to see some games right here that you can play you can uh, i think i think this particular one has to do with prediction uh like uh, football prediction and so many other ones like that i think event as event two is part of it so this one you predict you, you predict football and so many other just like all these sport betting websites and the like so but mind you it's free you like you are not using real money right here so and also this is another one this for uh full money and snake light so you can just play around with many of the with any of these games right here and then also you can you can refer people as well if you if you are the referral type you can you, you just copy your link and refer people so if you want to register make sure you use my link in the description below i i had to go so many lengths in order for me to you know to crack this all of their this all of their of their own hundred transaction kind of nonsense okay so okay uh this is the check-in page so make sure you come over to this page every single day and and check in and also this transaction mile right here so if i, ref if I refresh this let me press 
the refresh button and yeah, as you can see i'm already on 47 so this is going to is going to continue to to get to 100 and if i click on my my workspace right now you see that this transaction keeps on going it never stops so that is just the beauty of this particular bot but mind you have it at the back of your mind that you could get disqualified for this but then it is risk i'm willing to you know i'm willing to take but if you don't want to take that risk you can do it manually on your own but this is a you know this is a risk i'm willing to take and uh, like like many of you all know here we farm different projects and all that so i won't be spending three hours just to send transactions for 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 a, for a one particular project so 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 that's just it so this transaction will keep on you know going on going on on and on and on So guys the entire transaction has gone through how did i know so it's going so once once the transaction stops and it shows git uh gitpod workspace bot sonic and all that so and it's uh, showing this message right here so that is an indication that this has already completed all the transactions so let me go to to the transaction right here and refresh this so if i reload this page you're going to see 100 over 100 transactions okay you've made 100 transactions today so let me click on this claim this and also claim this so by now i should be having like 81 mystery boxes yeah so i'm having 81 right now so also you can open this any of this you can open this box this right here anytime in order for you to get this ring right here so if you open you could get five rings you get two you get one and so many other if i click on load more right here you see the you see my my history right here the time i got one two five one four one, two, and so many, and so on like that. So that's just it when it comes to to this uh to this opening of mystery box right here. So the next thing you want to do after this whole thing, after this whole thing, is to is to go back to your Git board or work uh, dashboard. Let me click on my Git board. So this is my workspace. Now this is what I just I just use right uh, right now. This is what I just use right now. So I'm going to delete this because I don't want it to to be using my credit the credit i uh, the free credit i have right here and and i i only i i only have free i, I mean the free the free credit i have is will be renewed every single month by itself so so i so i don't want every, because you're still going to do it tomorrow this same process you're going to do it tomorrow so i click on delete so i've deleted this and that is all for this so mind you you need to come back every single day to come and repeat this whole process right here i'm going to put the link to all these pages in the description below so that you guys can uh, can can get it and use it use the video as a reference every single day when you are running this thing so 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 guys so you need to be doing this every single day so that by the time they end this that season two you might have been able to get up to like three thousand or more or more of these their mystery box and by the time you open them and you know you could be having something like uh uh, something like a three thousand plus rings right here so i'm still having 66 right now so if i open all this right here i'm pretty sure i'm going to cross over 200 if i open all this so guys that is just it so you're going to be doing this every single day every single day and um, even if you are unable to do that that particular one just make sure you do this this checking make sure you do this this particular checking right here make sure you do this and this is a transaction man so this one is needed this one is easy this is the easiest one right here to do but mind you just watch the video and and do this particular one anytime you have you have the time to do it so that is just it guys if you appreciate my effort in this video kindly make sure you like this video and also leave a comment in the comment se in the comment section that I, I want you to type r u n that is wrong type the word r u n in the comment section so that i know that you watch this to the end and also make sure that you subscribe to this channel if you are yet to subscribe so i'll see you guys in my next video bye for now